Hey fam, welcome back to the Philip Scott Show. I am Ongil Zalalem bringing you the story. Today's story is about Jordan Woods. She is getting dragged on social media, especially Twitter. After she posted a picture of herself, a before and after showing that she has lost a lot of weight and promoting uh, working out up. And people did not take that lightly and they were offended. Many people were offended and um, okay, my thoughts on this. I'm sure Jordan Woods worked really hard on her body, worked out, ate well to lose the weight. But I am also aware that she had some surgery done like a BBL, right? So I am not... I'm not judging her as harshly because I believe it's still a lot of work working out, watching what you eat and all that. A BBL won't give you that body. A BBL won't do that alone. It needs work. You need to be able to be consistent in your workout as well. You need to be able to contribute to whatever the doctor did for you. And if you've seen her face, her face also lost weight. You know, it's not, I don't think that's surgery. She had to lose weight for her to be the size that she is. Maybe the shape was sculpted. I'm pretty sure it was, but I don't know. People say that it is BBL because when you do lose weight, you're going to lose it all or tone down. You're not going to have that hourglass shape the way that they want us to believe on social media. It's all natural. All women look like that. Well, there are women that look like that, but not a lot of them, okay? Not a lot of us look like that. So even though I get why people are upset, I 100% agree with people saying, you are promoting an app uh, for working out and, and you're telling young girls that are following you, millions of young girls, you're telling them that, look at me, I got this by working out and the girls will start working out. Probably they don't see results or when they do lose the weight, they're not going to have your shape and they are left wondering, what, what is this? Like, is it a me thing? How come my favorite influencers on social media have this bomb bodies, like sculpted bodies, and I'm the only one that doesn't have that? And they're not able to understand um, that that is surgery because you are telling them that you worked out to get there, which is also partially true, but you have to tell the whole entire truth. You did lose weight by working out, great, but also tell them that there are certain things you tweaked and did as well so that they can understand what exactly happen so that in the future they can decide like oh okay Jordan Woods had to have surgery as well as work out do I want the same thing allow them to make that decision based on facts so you not telling them all of the facts and just withholding some giving them a little bit and promoting an app to gain money is kind of shady so I get why people are pissed but my only counter to that is I'm pretty sure she worked hard and she's still working hard to maintain that body and to lose the fat so I, I applaud her for that well done to her the before and after picture is self-explanatory she has really lost weight and she's confident with herself she looks good good for her all I'm gonna say is she she has to be transparent. All these people on social media, they sell us, you know, uh, tea telling us that it's gonna give us flat tummy while they got surgery to get that flat tummy or they sell to us waist trainers and they tell us they got it through that, they're getting paid to promote that or them themselves are the ones selling that waist trainer so they're getting money but we don't see results. We, we are always constantly comparing ourselves to them and thinking how come hers looks good even though we're using the same product but the truth is we're not using the same products. She got surgery. I'm just trying to get a flat tummy with the waist trainer she's trying to sell to me. So yeah, there's no transparency there. That's the one thing I'll say. Like you have to be transparent. I'm not taking away from Jordan Woods or other people that worked hard. Even the Kardashians, I know we're hard on them. Chloe, you know, if you follow her on social media, she's always in the gym and she's working out. But the unfortunate thing is they will not show you the surgery part of it. They're just showing you I'm working out, working out, working out. And other people try the working out route and they're like, how come I'm not getting the same results? Because they're not telling us that they got surgery. They had another help added to the way they eat and they're working out. So 
yeah she's getting dragged i understand why they're dragging her but i also understand where where she's coming from when she said she worked out for that body i'm sure she did but she also had surgery so let's be fair let's be transparent if we're going to be transparent let's be 100 percent transparent so that the young girls that are following her don't end up doubting themselves don't end up you know being depressed because of basically a lie or half truth anyways let us know down below what your thoughts are about jordan woods do you think she's right for advertising a working out app when she got help with her body other than working out or you think it's perfectly fine and she's just telling us half truth half truth is good as the truth <laughs> i'm on gilzalal i'm bringing you the story i will see you on the next one bye